Hey guys, today I am going to be doing the my Premier League 2021-22 predictions video and basing off of their current standings. Um, yeah. So the first, so first of all, we're going to go from twentieth to first in their current positions. So in 20th is Leeds, 19th is Norwich, 18th is Crystal Palace, 17th is Arsenal, um, 16th Southampton, 15th Newcastle, 14th Wolves, 13th Man City, Twelfth Burnley, eleventh Aston Villa, tenth Spurs, ninth Leicester City, eighth Brighton, seven Watford, six Brentford, five Everton, four West Ham, three Liverpool, two Chelsea, and Manchester United finishing top of this list. But, but please note these are only the current ratings and not how, how I think these will end. We are now going to move on to how I think um, this Premier League will end. And we're going to start with the relegation section just because of the fact to get the negativity out of the way first. And then get on with the positivity. So, who I think is going to win? So, twentieth, I think Leeds United, and I think this because they lost five one against um, Manchester United, who are way further up, and they're currently twentieth as well. So 19th I have put Crystal Palace. Again they lost 3-0 to Chelsea in match day one. Um, and yeah. Brighton they went from like 1-0 down to like 2-1, 3-1 victory. Still don't watch a lot of Brighton games uh, myself. Um, no idea how good their players are. I'm not a Brighton fan. They've been so close to relegation every year. So, yeah. 17th, I have put Norwich. If you don't know where Nor Norwich is, it is a pain to get to. It's literally the furthest out city, I believe. Like, furthest east city. Like, yeah. I don't know. Near the North Sea. Sixteenth, I have Southampton. Um, they lost, obviously, against Everton. I think it was in match day one to so make them in sixteenth. And yeah, fifteenth. I think everyone can agree with this, apart from where they currently are, Arsenal. And I think, well, I don't know. Then they lose like 3 0 on match day one against Brentford or something. I don't know. I don't watch football. I'm only a Chelsea fan. I'm an England fan. I stream the games just for fun. Simple as. 14th, Newcastle. So, as we saw in the live stream on Sunday, that they scored early. They scored early. They scored in the fifth minute against um, whoever they played, West Ham United. But the thing is, they also conceded four times in that game with, um, when, they, when they scored two. So they conceded four, time, uh, four times, two of which being, so one being three minutes apart from the other. So, yeah. 13th, I have Brentford. And 
Like same again. They won three 0 against Arsenal on match day one, which was the first day of the Premier League. And uh, yeah, in twelfth, Burnley. And um, yeah, we're going to speak about transfers. Like if I know what just transfers have come in, gone out, etc., etc. In 11th, I've gone with Aston Villa. Obviously, losing Grealish very recently. He's gone to Manchester City. And, uh, yeah. Villa, you 11th. And then I've put the guys, my third favourite football team, internal football team, I mean, um, 10th, which is obviously Watford United. Oh, I think it's just Watford, I don't know. And, um, yeah. They have an amazing goalkeeper, Ben Foster. Don't want to self uh, don't want to promote, but if you want to go subscribe, I will leave a link to the Ben Foster channel in the description. He does GoPro in the goal. And these next team I've put, this next team I've put solo because of their captain could be going and that is man uh tottenham hotspur and um yeah they are 10th 9th even because harry kane could be going to manchester city <clears throat> eighth i've put everton can't let their fifth so they've gone, uh, in my prediction, they'll go down three places. Mm. I don't think they'll make the um, UEFA, whatever it is. You know, oh, I don't know what it is. What, fifth place? I don't think they will. I think they're just, I think, yeah. Seventh, West Ham. And uh, seeing their performance against um, Newcastle this Sunday just gone, um away as well so yeah that was amazing they're currently above everton i think they will finish above everton only by one place though and um yeah also can i please say um that um when premier league season is over i will be doing a reaction to this versus where they actually finish um, and yeah so and top six now I honestly think this next one is not going to come in at all Wolverhampton <laughs> I don't know why I put Wolverhampton in six I had two teams left but when making this list and it was Wolverhampton Newcastle. And if I'm honest, I should have put Newcastle here. But no, I put Wolves in sixth place. And then, my opinion, the top five are going to be very, very interesting this year. Being Manchester United. Uh, being the teams of Chelsea, Liverpool, Leicester, and both Manchester clubs. So, in fifth, I've put Manchester United. Um, just because, well, the top, the teams that I have in top two, um, are, are yeah, you know, um, are I've had. Good transfers this season. Maybe giving it away there. And um, yeah, fourth place. Fourth place then is Leicester City. Um, don't they usually have Pickford in goal? He got the Golden Glove Euro 2020. I don't know. I honestly do not know. Third place, Liverpool. Liverpool, third place. Don't they have like Mo Salah? Um, yeah. Six. 
second, I've put my my well fan favourite here, Chelsea. If you do not know about Chelsea, Premier League last year didn't win. We got close. We were in the top four. Um, then we won the Champions League, and then we played about a week ago now in the Super Cup, and we won that. So, so they've won twice in like three months. No, two, three months. Uh, two, three, four months apart. Yeah. No, wait, I don't know. I don't know. And then obviously that meaning Manchester City winning the Premier League in my prediction. A lot of you can agree with me here. Manchester City have made good transfers. They've made one already. Just can they get Harry Kane before the window closes? So, can I also just speak about the winner who I think is going to le win League One? PSG. Paris Saint Saint Germain, whatever it is. PSG are going to win, win League One. And, uh. Because, yeah. Let's just say Messi's there. Uh. Neymar's there. And there's news, well, what I've seen on Twitter, I don't know how true this is, um, that um, Ronaldo might be going there. So if that happens, everyone else is doomed. <laughs> Messi, Ronaldo and Neymar, nuh -uh. Also, can I just go back to Chelsea? We are, we sold a player for like around 40 million. We've brought that same player back this year. Um, for 97 million, I think. I don't know. But, anyway, Lukaku is coming back. He should be in action for the next match. Which I believe is Chelsea v Arsenal on Sunday at half past four BST. Anyway. Anyways, guys, this is my Premier League prediction video. I will be making a video next year about how true I was and whatever else finish. So thank you all so much for watching. I will see you later today for another live stream.